My God shall supply all your needs, not me, because I know I am supplied. My God shall supply your needs according to the glorious riches found in Christ Jesus. Bayonet. 
Patalim, bayonet. Hindi <laughs> bayonet. But the weapon that we carry is Jesus. Jesus. That's why Paul never used violence after he got being saved. Si Saul ay gumamit ng espada para ipaglaban ang kanyang paniniwala. Ngayon, nung nakilala niya si Jesus, hindi ng espada ang kanyang gamit ko niya ang salita. Ang salita na nagbibigay noon siya'y mamamatay tao, ngayon siya'y nagbibigay ng buhay sa tao. Mamili kayo. Kayo ba'y mamamatay tao? O nagbibigay buhay sa tao? Amen! Saan kayo doon? Nagbibigay. Amen. Kung tayo nagbibigay buhay, we say the life. We speak life. We speak the word of God. Difficult, but Jesus says it is life and easy. Why does He say this? Because because it means that when we do those rigorous and strenuous disciplines, depending on Him, pati sa pagkanta, hindi ka naman kagad naging magaling na singer, kung di ka dadaan dun sa, sa, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> di ka naman kagad magiging ano, kung wala nang turo sa ilang posture, paano tumayo? Tama, it requires discipline. Now you are a singer, but, for in able for you to be able to grow, you need discipline. Hindi mo pwede nga practice nga, tapos dating ng ten, may wala ka na lang tutunan. Tama? Mga kapatid? Hmm. Simpleng bagay yan. Pati rin sa ating workplaces. Wag po tayong pasaway sa ating workplaces. Kapag may pasok bukas, matulog ng maaga. Amen to that. <laughs> When I preach, I preach to myself as well. Pag may pasok bukas, pwede ka mo manood ng... Sige, manood ka buong araw ng Sabado ba? Give time for your health because God wants you healthy. Amen! That is our health. But when you abuse yourself, that is your own fault, right? And life because the energy will be supplied by you. Amen. Sabi ko, Noong Friday, parang antok na antok ako. Para akong parating pagod. Pero hindi ko dineclare. Because sabi ko, alam ko, ang word ng Lord. Ako ay malakas, ako ay strong. Kaya talagang everything that is scheduled on that day, natupad. At saya, saya ko pa. <laughs> Dahil ang saya ay hindi nagagaling sa atin, kundi sa kanya. Na nagsusupply ng lahat ng biyan. My God! shall supply all your needs, not me, because I know I am supplied. My God shall supply your needs according to the glorious riches found in Christ Jesus. And all the people say, Amen. Yes. And that is, mga kapatid, when we depend on Him, when we depend on Him, that is the second rest that we experience. That's why first is the rest that He gave us salvation and the second rest is our maturity in Christ Jesus. And I pray that all of us will grow in this grace that we as well offer the salvation of God to the world. Amen? So army of God, be at rest. You have the rest of God and continue, I pray that you continue to to grow in grace and in the knowledge of Him because all the glory goes to Him. When we know more of Jesus, the more we see that He is so great, He is so powerful, powerful to save, powerful to do things on our behalf for our own good. Thank you, Lord, for choosing us in this way. Thank you for loving us with an everlasting love. We acknowledge you. We thank you for this rest. Oh, powerful Jesus. There is power truly in the name of Jesus. And those who are watching right now, maybe this is the first time you hear this message. I pray that you will uh, receive the invitation of Jesus. If you are not a Christian and if you are not sure what is your uh, relationship with God, God is making sure your, his relationship with you right now. I pray that you will receive him. Those who are watching in the tele, in the live stream, 
You can pray this prayer. Father, I thank you that I receive now Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. Now I am saved. I am forgiven of all my sins of what he has done on the cross. And I believe of his death, burial, and resurrection. That in my heart I believe he is alive today. And now I am alive and I have eternal life. In Jesus' name. Amen. And if you pray this prayer from your heart and speak it, you are truly saved. You are now, you now belong to the family of God. And this is the rest God wants for you. And I pray that the second rest will be you to choose the right church, the right person to preach the pure gospel of grace. And I pray for all of us to experience spiritual growth. There will be things in life that you will experience uh, challenge in the flesh, uh, things that uh, maybe uh, makes give you an irritants or uh, mga kabagaba, mga bagaba na hindi necessary. But because you choose to grow, you will surpass all of them, and you will experience the rest of Christ and healing, prosperity, inward and outside. Ah, inside and out, Lord. We thank you for giving us these things. That's why we take the yoke because your burden is light. Amen and amen. We thank you, Mother, for today. We rest upon you. You are the true rest. You are our restful increase in everything that we do, Lord. We thank you. We thank you, oh God. Can we sing the song? Uh, the, uh, the first song. Spirit lead me when my trust is without borders. Let me walk upon the waters wherever you draw me. Take me deeper than my feet could bear. My faith now is made stronger in the presence of my Savior. Oh, 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 oh. And sing the chorus. I will call. I will call on your name. Keep my eyes above the way. So we're ready. 